Hi, I'm Dennis Cometti. It's time to play Sunday afternoon football. Well, the heat here is unrelenting. Look at that steam coming off the ground. A player who always knew how to find the goals and did so 800 times in his illustrious career. From my point of view, it's a delight to have him as part of the commentary team. Welcome, Richo. What a game we have here today, Dan. There's been quite a build-up for this one. Today's match, Greater Western Sydney and the Eagles. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. Giants enter the arena. We have the toss of the coin. Greater Western Sydney kicking to the right of screen. Round four, coming off a string of losses. This is a clash that makes King Kong versus Godzilla look like a chimpanzee's tea party. I can't wait for this encounter to begin, and I think the crowd would agree with me too. They're on the edge of their seats. We're underway. The opening bounce cleared by Glob. Bounces favorably for Vardy. My set with the ball. Stabs the ball. Nice work from Io. You'd back him from this position. Io shoots. Misses the goal and goes through for a behind. Point the difference. Shield to bring it in. Marked by Coniglio. Gets boot to leather. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. Buntin kicks it. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. Delivio slams the ball onto his boot, trying to get it away as quickly as possible. Tapped by Tomlinson. It's out of bounds across the boundary on the wing. The ball going back to the players right now. Lysette. It's just a real slippery customer if you give him any space. He knocks it down. He gets a fist to it. Lob picks up the ball. He goes for home. He kicks the ball, concentrating hard as he lines up the goal. Not a pretty drop punt, but it gets away okay. Green, urged on by the crowd, prepares to kick. Green taking a chance at goal. The first goal of the match. Like a banana through a letterbox. What a wonderful goal. His teammates rush over. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. Here's the bounce. Lysette thumps it forward. Gets the loose ball. Kennedy has the ball. He has the ball. Guided down nicely by Kennedy. Strong mark by McGovern. 50 metres from home, boots it. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. And he's kicking on a 30-degree angle. This could prove difficult for him. From the movie of the same name, a beautiful behind by Kio. Less than one goal in this match. The Eagles still very much in it. He'll be looking to spot the player on the burst. Archie taps it. Wow, what a nose for those loose balls. Archie with the mighty fist kicks it. Buntin spills it. The loose ball picked up. West Coast is down by less than a kick. Shield's just got a lot of tricks in the bag, which makes him so very hard to stop. 
He's also got an amazing highlight reel. Coniglio drops the ball. The ball has been grabbed on the bounce. He steals the ball on the bounce. Coniglio gets the footy. He boots it. Yo, with good strong hands. Gets boot to high. Nice mark there. He lays it on the boot for a giant kick. And the ball goes over the boundary near the 50. Look at the big eaters. They're doing their exercise now as this ball comes into play. Wood with the pass. Kicks it across the ground. Takes control of the bouncing ball. DeBoer looks hurt. Richo, can you tell us more on that? DeBoer will see no further action after that injury. Tackle, but gets the handball off. Booted by Hutchings. Marks. Shuey with the kick. Barras takes it well. Barras can read the play really well. I think he's definitely on his way to becoming one of the best in the league. Coniglio passes it. He kicks the ball. A good contested mark there. Hastily kicked. Ward alone for the uncontested mark. Nice drop pass. Whitfield looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. Let's hope the shot at goal is as good as the delivery. 45 metres out. Shot by Buckley. Shepard gets the upper hand. Shepard obviously loves playing for the club. I can't imagine him being anywhere else. Whitfield kicks for goal. Magnificent goal. GWS put on top of West Coast. He's loving that replay. <laughs> and he's making sure his opponent knows all about it. Whitfield knows that was something special. All is in readiness. Bounce goes the ball. Tap to advantage. Cripps with the football. Ball up in the centre square. Guided down nicely by Glob. He takes control of the loose ball. He kicks the ball out of congestion. Runs out of room. And he's over the boundary line. We'll have a throw in. Ruckman hard at it. They set punches. The spilled ball is collected. He doesn't know the meaning of the word fear. In fact, it's fair to say he doesn't know the meaning of a lot of words. Takes the mark all by himself. Booted by Darchi. Duggan was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Duggan has got good knowledge of the game, and he can see the events unfolding in front of him, but he just needs to react a little faster. Puts boot to ball. He marks the ball. He gets boot to the ball. He gets the upper hand. Payne kicks from the pack, has he? Yes, he's paid it. Popper with the kick. Well, he gave it a shot. It bounced straight into his hands as if he'd just called a puppy with a whistle. I set decisively. Tapped by Hutchings. Hutchings taps. He gets tackled as he hands it off. Head down now as he goes in for the goal. Tapped by Chi. And the ball crosses over the boundary. The umpire says, throw it in. The umpire has released the ball. Good fist. Shaw collects it. He boots it from the pack. Strong mark. Grips kicks. Strong mark by Durant. Bumps the big skin. Schofield with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. Lecrack marks it. Lecrack. If you want to be a hero, now is the time to put your hand up. Time to check the stats, Richo. The tackling abilities on display from both sides appear close on the scoreboard with West Coast on six and GWS on five.
GWS have 23 kicks. And here's the start of the second term. Always make a total effort, even when the odds are against you. He gets his hands on the footy. The umpire wants to ball it up. Lob with the tap. Vardy controls. His sidestep was marvellous, like a shaft of lightning. He prays to the god of blessed acceleration. Kicked by Barantz. She marks it. This will have to be his very best kick to score from this range. The big kick for goal goes straight through. He sinks his first goal. The Eagles in front now. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. Very happy with that kick. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Lob, punches, Buckley taps. Deft touch from Tomlinson, pick up by McKenzie. He lays off the pass, jams it on the boot. Cord, the better man there. 50 metres out, he's kicking on about a 30 degree angle, which could prove challenging. 35 metres out. Buckley now with a chance to grab the lead for his side. Greater Western Sydney get back on top again. Buckley can achieve anything he sets his mind to. The sky is the limit for this guy. There's one for the time capsule. Buckley is relieved to see that one go through. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. And there's the bounce. Lob got the hit out. Bounces favorably for Vardy. A low stabbing kick. Tomlinson has seen plenty of the footy. Goes by hand. Delivio starts in, his shadow beside him. Where else would it be? Well, it depends on the side. Green puts it on the boot. Almost a touch of synchronized swimming about that mark. That was the peg. The goal's right in front of Buckley. Going for goal number two. Score for the Giants. The Giants in front. Buckley got a really good footballing brain. That replay shows just how good that goal was. He's excited about that one. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. A dead straight bounce. Lob gets the tap. Scoops up the bouncing ball. Don't know how he managed to get that out of the pack. Kicks it. Bounces favorably for Whitfield. Marked by DeBoer. Word is this guy is the most reliable kick for goal in the side. DeBoer pulls the trigger with the ball sailing for goal. The Giants by 15 points. DeBoer needs to practice his goal kicking routine. It helps the player handle any situation in the game. If he does that more often, then he might enter the league of the elite goal kickers. That replay shows just how good that goal was. DeBoer chose the goal umpire the right signal. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. The bounce laser straight. Lob guides it. Buckley charges fiercely with a powerful bump. The loose ball scooped up. Sends the Sharon on its way. The Rats has it. Gets boot to high. Solid as a rock and he comes away with a lovely contested mark. Yeo gets the upper hand. 35 metres out. 
going for goal number one. That was a poor kick, wasn't it, Richard? That will haunt him in his sleep. Big trouble for West Coast. They need to kick a few now. Shield can read the play really well. I think he's definitely on his way to becoming one of the best in the league. He drops the mark. He's blocked it. Popper boots it. Plenty of space for a very easy mark. He kicks the ball. Guided down nicely by Glob. He lays it on the boot for a giant kick. Be decisive. Come on, be decisive. A wrong decision is generally less disastrous than indecision. That ball's traveling. Whitfield wasting that opportunity completely. He's kicked that straight into the confectionery stand, out on the full. No one troubling him there. Core kicks it. Simply outplayed the opposition there. Vardy with the kick. Nice mark there. Kicks it across the ground. A solid mark from Popper. Jams it on the boot. Whitfield from behind. A routine, strictly speaking, is not a routine if you have to think about it. Going for goal number two. It's in the air. Whitfield gets the goal with an ambitious kick. He's bagged a couple now. This one gives them an even bigger lead. Replays are great when you can see how talented these guys are at conjuring something out of nothing. Celebration time after that one for Whitfield. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. More bounce than a dodgy check. Lob. He's just a real workhorse in the ruck, and I reckon his teammates really appreciate his uncomplicated approach to the game. A goal to GWS. GWS Carove at the Eagles. And that goal is right off the top shelf for him. Celebration time after that one for Buckley. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. My set not even close to getting a hit out. He might have to take a leaf out of the karate kid and sweep the knee. The contest, no match for him. The Rats with the kick. And the mark will be paid. Jams it on the boot now. Good mark by Gio. He'll need a long-range boomer from here. Gio hammers the ball for goal. The Eagles trail Greater Western Sydney. Shield gets set to kick it back in. He kicks it to himself. Choose to kick it. Haynes grabs that one. Haynes has got a few tricks up his sleeve, so defenders will have to be on their game. He slams that on the boot. The mark will be paid. Ward puts his boot on it. Lob gets the upper hand. Puts boot to ball. He picked it up off the ground. My set taps it. My ball says the umpire. Lob aims for his man on the ground. Umpire not hesitating to call the ball up right there. My set totally outclassed in that contest. He gathers the loose ball. Vardy gets the ball. He gets another possession. Nice mark there. Kicked by Barras. Gio marks it. Let's have the shot at goal is as good as the delivery. 40 minutes from home. The ball is stumped towards goal by Gio. Miss for behind. Not enough help gained from that kick. The Eagles trailing. Shield to bring it in. Plays on. Slams it on the boot. Marked by Griffin. Sends the Sharon on its way. Got his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. He spears the ball. Well, he gave it a shot. Haynes taps it. Patton taps. Scoops up the ball. Hopper holding the ball as he's collected by Schofield. Kicks it.
Let's take a look at the stats, Richo. The huge difference in score is not reflecting minuscule difference in stats. The Giants are just making it count at the right times. Cheers, Richo. Two quarters down and only two to go. Players have taken to the ground looking refreshed and they're ready, so let's get the third term going. The difference between the impossible and the possible lies in a person's determination. Lobb, got a fist on it. He has the ball. Chewy with the football, sends it on its way. Great mark. Kicks it. The mark is taken by Hopper. Hopper, he's quite clean, picking up the ball on the half volley. He boots it. The mark will be paid. Poor slams the ball to his boot. Whitfield with the ball. Puts boot to ball. Kept his composure then. Marston slams it on the boot. Schofield claims it. Not a pretty drop punt, but it gets away okay. The mark is taken by Haynes. Gets boot to leather. Solid as a rock, and he comes away with a lovely contested mark. Hopper marks it. Slams it on the boot. Kennedy marks it. Kicks. Marked by Redden. Boots it. Haynes gets the interception on the bounce. We get a ball up on the wing. Lysette didn't even get close to that tap. Shuey with the tap. Shaw guides it. Shuey feeds it wide. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. Sends it on its way. Nice mark under pressure. Cripps will be kicking from, as they would say, downtown. He's on a 30-degree angle. She taking a chance at goal. West Coast has still a chance, given that this season we've seen teams blow more leads than Inspector Clouseau. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. She shows the goal umpire the right signal. The Rucks prepare to go at it for this bounce. Great bounce. Lob with the first touch. Penetrating hand pass. The ball bounced to the advantage of the opposition. He runs into the goal. The kick just clears the line for a goal. Buckley getting his fourth right there. This lead getting bigger now. He scores, he scores, he scores. What an absolute classic. You can see it on his face. He's happy with that effort. The Ruckman giving each other the ice-cold killer stare-downs as they wait for the bounce. Lysette will give you a competitive contest in every hit-out, I can assure you of that. But the midfielders are going to have to work really hard to earn the centre clearances off his ruck work. He clears the ball. He hand-passes it. Shuey intercepted that well. Schofield by hand. Redden kicks the ball. It's a mark. Stabs the ball. He's racking up possessions. Dio making his way in. Let's hope he's compensated for the win. So close, but just a behind. That won't help. They need a goal. West Coast are really under the gun here. 
Chill has a fair kick on him. I expect him to loose this down the middle. Jams it on the boot now. Wood with the mark. Boots it. Haynes has a great set of hands. Fantastic mark. He has clearly been shopping at Clang as a Russ. He couldn't hang on. Wow, what a nose for those loose balls. Chill gets the tap. He's got the football now. Drops the ball. The ball bounced to the advantage of the opposition. Lobs the pass. Sends the Sharon on its way. Redden with a low spearing kick. Schofield having no trouble taking that one. Schofield, he's quite clean, picking up the ball on the half volley. West Coast lagging behind the Giants on the scoreboard. He's loving that replay, <laughs> and he's making sure his opponent knows all about it. Dio knows that was something special. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. Both rucks have a fair shot at this one. Long. I've seen better swings on a condemned playground. Ball up in the center square. Long. Got a fist on him. He gets tackled as he hands it off. Stabs the ball. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. Kennedy sends the ball on its way. Whitfield with a chance if he keeps a cool head. A long way out. He's kicking on about 45 degrees from here. Fantastic goal by Whitfield. This kick has extended their lead. The Giants by 23. He scores, he scores, he scores. What an absolute classic. Very happy with that kick. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. The ball has been bounced. GWS could just absolutely dominating the clearances. No doubt that's why they're winning. Ward running towards goal. Good mark. Lining it up with the goal now. Green takes a shot. Hit the post. That's a behind. Shepard gets set to kick it back in. Scoops up the bouncing ball. Vardy marks it. Boots it. Nice mark there. Gets boot to high. Great mark. Marston slams it on the boot. Duggan coughs it up. Not sure what he was trying to attempt there, but the ball has changed possession. Shuey kicks hard along the boundary line. And the mark will be paid. Low spearing kick. Takes that one strongly. Duggan is really good at reading the play out on the field. He just needs to start doing it faster. Popper kicks it. He manages to intercept the bouncing ball. Puts boot to ball. A nice contested mark. He has a mighty kick at the footy. Great grab. The ball finds its way into the grateful clutches of the opposition. A great effort. All of a sudden the ball has become a hot potato. Quickly disposed of by Ward. Out of bounds on the wing. It's a good throw in. Effective hit out there. I set onto the ball. Interception. McGovern doesn't waste that opportunity. He really should have made more of that. Fair to say that'll have little impact on the scoreboard. The Eagles are really under the gun here. He has a few options. Plays onto himself. Picture perfect drop punt. Let's go to Richo now and take a look at the stats. West Coast stats not reflecting their poor effort on the scoreboard. Hmm, that's pretty deep, Richo.
The players are starting to feel the strain of the first three quarters now. Even when you played the game of your life, it's the feeling of teamwork that you'll remember. You'll forget the marks, the tackles and the goals, but you'll never forget your teammates. The ball in the hands of Delidio with the ball now. Cripps passes. He's really a ball magnet. Sends the Sharon on its way. She taps. Shield with the tap. Tapped by Bunteen. He's got the footy in his hands. Almost a mark, but it bounces off his chest. Schofield has been violating the golden rule of kindergarten. He's not playing well with others. Delidio taps it. He picks it up. Duggan pummels him, but the kick gets away in time. Hopper gets the tap. Batted down nicely by Nelson. And a free kick going against Schofield. Kicked by Shaw. Solid as a rock, and he comes away with a lovely contested mark. A good mark under the circumstances. Booted by Glob. And the mark will be paid. Poor. He's the heart and soul of this footy club. I don't think he'll be going anywhere anytime soon. Buckley kicks for goal. Buckley, you beauty. The Giants go really looking the goods with the lead over at West Coast. Lucky we have that goal recorded because it was first rate. Celebration time after that one for Buckley. The Ruckman giving each other the ice-cold killer stare-downs as they wait for the bounce. Long outstretches his opponent to win the Ruck. And the ball goes out of bounds. It'll be the umpire's ball. The umpire's with a good throw. I said not even close to getting a hit out. We might have to take a leap out of the karate kid and sweep the knee. Whitfield takes a shot at goal. Whitfield scores with a beautiful kick. He's kicked four and he looks like he's not done scoring yet. They increase their lead. Whitfield has been a solid contributor for this team. His coach will know what to expect from him week to week, which really helps when structuring the team. And that goal is right off the top shelf for him. Whitfield with the goal, and he runs back into position. The Rucks prepare to go at it for this bounce. Umpire bounces the ball. Tapped by Lysette. Schofield, I've got no idea how he managed to get that out. Head down now as he goes in for the goal. Yeo taking a chance at goal. Lots of time left to play. The margin might be a little too big, though. Like a banana through a letterbox. What a wonderful goal. Congratulated by his teammates. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. The bounce laser straight. Lob directs it down. Takes control of the bouncing ball. The contest, no match for him. Kicked by Shaw. Strong mark. Buckley picks it. DeBoer with the mark. Picks it. Marks. Talking to a football doesn't do much good unless you do it while your opponent is lining up. Long. Shoots. He'll be happy with that. This kick stretches the lead. The Giants are in control of this game. I've got to say, that's even a better goal the second time around. Smiles all round. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Long taps it, takes control of the bouncing ball, finding the running player. 
He runs into the goal, going for goal number one. He was celebrating the moment that left his boot. A much-needed goal for the Eagles. I've got to say, that's even a better goal the second time around. Lysette chose the goal umpire the right signal. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. Here's the bounce. Batted down nicely by Glob. Vardy goes to midfield. Great grab. Picked by Barance. Yo presents and takes the mark. Yo. He's got a few tricks up his sleeve, so defenders will have to be on their game. It's in the air. Out on the full. Terrible. Out on the full. Free kick to the Eagles. Shield kicks out along the boundary line. She lining up. 35 metres out. A 45 degree angle for this kick. 20 metres from home. Not the easiest of angles, this one. He's taking the shot from about 30 degrees. West Coast have scored the last two goals. They could close the deal if they keep up the momentum. Yo, he's got good knowledge of the game and he can see the events unfolding in front of him, but he just needs to react a little faster. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley and it's a goal. Celebration time after that one for Theo. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. Here we go. Tapped by Lysette. Short handball short. Batted down nicely by Paynes. Tapped by Whitfield. Kennedy decisively. He keeps it alive despite the traffic around him. Shepard with the running catch. He takes an uncontested mark. Send the top in, big fella. Archie looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. A favorable bounce. Lysette guides it. Able to grab it on the half volley. Jams it on the boot now. Nice hands. Four takes a lot of marks during a game, but a lot of them seem to be juggled. If he can just get cleaner hands on the ball, it's just going to give his opponents less chance to spoil in the contest. Green marks the ball. You're back in from this position. Shot by Green. A magnificent kick right through the middle. He'll be happy with goal number two. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Cleared by Davis, he controls the bouncing ball. He gives the ball away. Davis feeds it wide. Kennedy ran to meet the ball and took the mark superbly. Court marks. Puts boot to ball. Buckley has it. Look at the concentration on his face as he lines up for the goal. 45 metres out. Going for goal number six. Greater Western Sydney by five goals. Shepard has a lovely kick on him. If he can utilise that in heavy traffic, he will become crucial to his team's finals ambitions. De Boer with the shot. De Boer has got it. GWS are in front. Oh, he'll be loving that goal when he sees it in the highlights package. You can see it on his face. He's happy with that effort. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. The ball bouncing well. Tap to advantage. He's got the football now. That play is as high-tech as a campfire. 
Shaw kicks it to the square. He couldn't hang on. Hopper with his head down, running for home. Nice hands. Nelson with a perfect drop punt. Nice hands. Schofield really wears his heart on his sleeve. He slams that on the boot. And the ball goes over the boundary line. He clears the ball. Deledio picks it up. Puts boot to ball. That's a mark. Puts boot to ball. Wood alone for the uncontested mark. Works it across the ground. The Eagles really have their pants pulled down on this occasion. Richo, did you enjoy the matchup between Greater Western Sydney and West Coast? Well, they got into a situation where they were a few goals down and all of a sudden the players lost faith and thought, why bother? It was like they decided that the scoreboard damage was too much and that they couldn't handle it any longer, so just gave up. The whole team switched off and that's why this turned out to be a blowout. Enlightening, Richo. Final scores are 86 to 50. Well, Richo, it's been a fun match. We've enjoyed that one. It was great being here, Dennis. I can't wait for the next match. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon.